This video will help you to create a table of values for a graph. You will find the key steps on the screen and I will demonstrate them live. Our graph will be for y equals 2x plus 1 for integer values of x between negative 2 and 3. Let's get started by choosing the Table app. The screen says that there isn't yet an equation entered. The calculator uses f brackets x instead of y. This is just another way of writing graph equations and is spoken as f of x. Start by pressing the Tools key and scroll down to define f of x slash g of x. Defining f of x means to enter the equation. So press OK for define and then choose f of x by pressing OK. Enter the equation 2x plus 1. It's easiest to use the dedicated x button. Press OK or the execute key which enters the equation into the calculator. Now you can tell the calculator the table values you want. Press Tools and press OK to choose Table Range. The start value will be negative 2, so enter negative, which is Shift, Subtract, and 2. Try to use negation rather than subtraction for negative numbers. Press OK or the Execute key to enter it. You want your end value to be 3, so enter 3, and again press Execute or the OK key. The step value is how much you want to increase each value of x. The question says integer values, which means steps of 1. As this is already entered, leave it and scroll down to see Execute. Press OK or the Execute key to create the table. The table shows the values which are the coordinates of the graph x and f of x, which remember means y. So for example, the first coordinate is negative 2, negative 3. You can scroll down to see further values of x and y. If you are using the ClassPad math emulator, Press the graph symbol on the toolbar below the emulator to display the graph. I think it's a good idea to practice using the table of values with different equations and exploring how it will help you to plot a graph.